All right, welcome back everyone to episode eight of Harada Bitter Breaths Adventures into Skyrim. You can see behind us the beautiful mountains back there, and the blue palace, all looks very nice. So we're here at Catless Farm. We were in the process of storing all of our items into this barrel, especially our ingredients. Uh, we have an available carry weight of around 50 and we were trying to figure out what to do, and then our plan was to steal a horse. Oh my god, look, we just got a, an invasion level up just from running around, that's pretty cool. Uh, and then the plan was to head over to the lighthouse and put it out. And I'll just tell you from, I, I did a really quick, I'll just be honest with you, I did a quick look up of the quest, and from a metagame perspective, this is probably going to be really difficult for us at our current level. Um, we're level 15, but our actual like hand-to-hand -hand combat abilities are very low, right? We're running around with a Dwarven Dagger. If we had an Ebony Dagger, I might be willing to kind of go full speed ahead, but we haven't had much of an opportunity to use our bow, to use our weapons, right? I mean, even just Marksman and One-Handed are, are still only like 15 and 17. We don't even have a perk in Marksman. Actually, we can do that right now. We can put a perk in a Marksman, there we go. Okay, so it's a good way to start the episode. But I'd really like to at least get probably our first perk here into Dagger Focus, because we know we're definitely gonna be taking daggers, like, you know, max out on this character. Uh, let's see. Unarmed attacks are faster? Eh. We don't really care about that. But being able to, to become more resistant before we get in direct face-to-face -face combat is going to be very important. And so there's a good chance that we are not going to be doing this quest yet. Probably closer to, like, level 20 or, uh, yeah, probably around level 20 is when we'll be okay. Instead, I think what we should do is make our way down to the Dark Brotherhood Sanctuary and prioritize that. At some point, especially now that we have a bunch of gold, I'm pretty sure we can bribe the guards. So if we ever return to Windhelm, we'll be able to do that and continue Blood on the Ice because we kind of ran out of there like really quickly because the guards started to recognize us. This also is probably going to be closer to level 25 because this, this is a really difficult quest. Um, Otherwise, yeah, adopts, you know, this, where, where was this located, right? Um, way over there. Rob, is it really Robber's Gorge? Oh, it is Robber's Gorge. Um, oh, oh my god, are we gonna pass through there? Yeah, we might be. We're gonna be passing through Robber's Gorge on our way down to the Dark Brotherhood Sanctuary. So there we go. Okay. That might be pretty good. Um, I think what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna head back into town. We're gonna cause a little bit more mischief there. Uh, we don't have any of our very expensive stolen items on us anymore. We've put them mostly away, especially some of our spider venom. If you remember, we we had like eight of them and we didn't, if, if we were arrested, we would have lost all of our spider venom and that would have been a big problem. So now we'll lose some of our spider venom. So we're gonna run into town, see what we can do. I, uh, we also need to restock remember we gave away our uh, water skins so we have to get those again so we're basically going to restock figure out um, if there's any other like quests or bounties we can kind of pick up that will bring us south because we are on our way right now all the way south down to Falkreath that's our goal for this episode is to head down to Falkreath because we're probably going to get some new equipment just by showing up at the, the Dark Brotherhood Sanctuary here and that's going to be pretty exciting so that's going to be the goal for our episode so let's stop back, stop back into town and see if there's anything else to do. This guard right here, right? Well, they have gold, some potions here. Zero percent chance to steal his bow. Um, let's try stealing his uh, his potion here. You have committed crimes oh. against Skyrim and her people. <laughs> what say you in your defense? <clears throat> uh. Uh, <laughs> um, oh my god, so we can resist, um, we can't wait too long. I think, I don't want to lose the two poisons we have in my inventory, right? So, 
How about I pay you some gold and you just look the other way? Since you put it that way, I think we can overlook your crime I'm, for now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for picking your pocket. Here's some gold. All right, well, we're off to a good start. We're at negative 300 gold. Rough. So rough. <laughs> Wait, is this an alchemy shop right here? Feel free to look around. We have a fine selection of herbs here at Angela's Aromatics. I just realized that this was an act. Like, I, I didn't even... Because I, I was looking for an alchemy shop. You know? Ugh. You're a traveler, correct? Have you been to Whiterun? Um, no. I've not, never been to Whiterun oh, well. before. It was a long shot. Need something? Hmm. That's interesting. Don't forget me, Nick. It's good to see a fresh face. You wouldn't... Have... So you're interested in my potions and ingredients? Hmm. Well, Until next time. we'll we'll buy a bunch of stuff in a moment. Let's see if there's anything we can't uh, borrow here, right? You know, and she's just kind of minding her own business, and uh, there they were, the spider venoms. We're always looking for extra spider venom. Paralysis, void salts, thank you very much. Stealing from the elderly. It's our specialty, right? You know it is. Hey, another spider venom. You all know it is, chat. What she have? Nothing. Oh, I, I watched her adjust and it was like... Are we able to get any of the gold here? Nice. Oh, what else? What else? Some robes. Oh, uh, yeah, we can take all this. Oh, these are enchanted, but their value's pretty low. Mm. Oh, more void salts. Anything else? A couple of these. Yeah, don't mind us. We're just cleaning, you know, cleaning your shelves, right? Excellent. That, uh, oh my god, we found more void salts? That's ridiculous. How many void salts that do we just find here? Three, three void salts. Are you serious? That is absolutely incredible. There's a uh, ice wraith teeth. Apparently we hadn't learned what those do yet. So. Yeah. Blah. We're learning that right now. Uh, it's a little difficult to take anything from there and then I don't know if she's gonna have anything good around here yeah she'll she'll follow us around up here so unless we can jump down from a higher level which I don't think we can it probably isn't worth it okay so what we'll do is we're gonna buy a couple of ingredients off of her uh, just because we, we do need more things. She's starting to get a little suspicious of us. But uh, that's that should be good enough, right? And um, we'll, we'll continue on our way. Ah, welcome to... Ah, so you're an alchemist then. Animal fat, sold, sold. Ooh. Is this the, oh my goodness, that is a lot of gold that we could try stealing, y'all. Wait, this is the gold that we paid him to ignore our crime. Y'all ready for this? <laughs> oh, oh my God, that is amazing. We just stole all of our gold back that we used to convince him to ignore our bounty. That is a really good thing to know that we have the ability to do. Oh my God. Wait a minute, the, the caravan there might have uh, some water skins. We couldn't find any water skins anywhere. 
Kind of heartbreaking. I welcome you. Take a look. Yeah, do you have any water skins? Water skins, water skins. No, he has big metal. Oh, um, I'm looking in look. the wrong one. Like a water skin. Nope. May your road no water skins. Warm well, maybe he has other. Do you seek to make? Take a look. Um, what's he got? What's he got? It's a really nice dwarven crossbow. It's impressive. Hide thing of restoration. Hmm. I like this brown mask. Let's buy it. It's like 25 gold. Any good, uh, oh. Allows you to pick expert locks. I don't know if that'll be worth it, right? But I do know that moon sugar can be very valuable as an alchemy ingredient. So we'll take all those. Anything we can, uh, oh, we can here, we can sell all of our like silver bowls and stuff that we picked up. Some of them are too expensive for us to sell, but that's okay. I hope that you will come. Let's take a look at what we look like with this mask, right? Uh, here, let's face the fire here. Let's see if we're, uh... oh, that is fantastic. It'll be more difficult to recognize us. I think this is exactly the type of thing that we would wear while running around Skyrim trying to commit crimes, right? Just making it more difficult for people to see her face. I think that's perfect. Come, come and see what goods I offer. Let's see, is anyone out here? Da -da, da -da. Alright, stable boys right there. Hey, hands off! Oh no! The kid saw me! Run! Ah! Well, that didn't work out too well. I guess we're wanted in a uh, in solitude now. <laughs> I think we're gonna spend the night in Dragon's Bridge. Mostly because this will also allow us to kind of claim our horse here. Helena the horse. Right, so we'll, uh. Oh! Manage horses. Excellent, so Helena is officially. like ours. Right? And uh, I guess she's, she's named Helena too. So, we have a horse named Helena. Nice. Oh no, we forgot all of our ingredients. We forgot all of our ingredients back up there. So what we'll do is we'll go. Oh no. Chat, we're gonna have to go back with our stolen horse. Uh, all right, we'll head back because we need those ingredients. Oh, I feel silly. What the hell? I knew it. Oh my god. There's a vampire. You think you stand a chance. Oh! No, get away from my horse. Oh, get away from me. Ah! She's still after me. Ah, she is, she is, she is! Help! 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 Someone help! Vampire! Vampire on the loose! She's attacking everyone! And I'm almost out of stamina! Vampire! Oh! Guard, help! Getting out of here! Oh my goodness. 
Okay. Vampire dust. Some other loot. A heart. Some nice jewelry. Oh. What the heck? So we're just gonna put the horse right here. I don't think they're gonna... I think everyone's asleep, right? Pretty sure everyone's asleep. So we'll just kinda... Hide in the back here. Take everything, so take all. And we're over encumbered now, but... Should be able to move carefully, stealthily, back to our horse. I guess we... Oh, oh, someone sees us! Who sees us? Someone saw us. Oh, I think it was the guard back over there. As long as, as, long as it's not the owners, right? Okay. Oh. Respect the law, and you'll have no trouble in Dragon Bridge. <laughs> took took me a minute. I was like, respect the what now? Um, do you have any Fate is the name. water Drink skins? For the thirsty, food for the hungry. No, looks like not. But uh, I'd like to rent a sure room. Thing. It's yours for a day. Great. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. That guy's watching us, so can't really can't really do anything, unfortunately. But let me know if there's anything else you need. She doesn't have anything in her pockets. It's kind of impressive, actually. Darn it. Nice. And, uh, let's see. The elk. We don't really need any elk antlers. What would we do with those? So. Okay, yeah. Let's have a little look around here, right? A lot of... A lot of mead and gold and stuff, but... We can stay hidden. Nice. Oh, of course, how could we forget? Being a thief and stealing all of your ingredients really is just fantastic. Look, we can even, uh, if, if we can get up there. No, it's, it's too risky, right? I'm worried he'll see us, so. Ooh, a chest. Let's see what's in here. Maybe it's gold. Or diamonds. Hey! Not bad. <laughs> it's, I'm still laughing. Follow the law. The what now? What's that? Yeah, okay. Bedtime. Bedtime. Do we need a bath? <sighs> well, we're, we're hungry and thirsty. So what we can do is... Uh... Mm. No, we should be all set. Let's just sleep. Seven hours should be good. Got like a real night's sleep. <clears throat> Fate is the name. I keep the inn. No, we might. All right, then. Here, Something um. Something different about you. I can tell. Hope you ain't here to cause trouble. <laughs> Let's sate that appetite. Hmm? Let's buy some uh, some water, because unfortunately, it doesn't look like we're gonna really be able to. Uh, All right then. Find anything else? Still parched. How are we now? Now we're still thirsty, so we had to drink three bottles of water. Just to uh, quench our thirst there. 
Oh boy, it's raining. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Okay. So we step outside and we get... Oh, the Harvest End Flyer. Excellent. Yeah, the 27th. Uh, today is 24th. So, doesn't really look like it's raining. We're just gonna... Let's see. Dump that. Anything else we can kind of dump? Hmm. That, that we just don't need. Yeah, the, the bottles. That's what it was. Nice. Excellent. Put some stuff on our horse, right? That, that. All the ingredients we stole. Excellent. What happened? Oh no, the uh, so we still have teardrop. It's just if you remember, we were kind of kidnapped in the middle of our sleep, so we stole another horse. So we are on our way back eventually to Riften, where uh, teardrop is parked outside. All right, there it is, Robber's Gorge. Now, as we were riding here, we, we went and acknowledged, we have seven, where is it? Oh, yeah, I guess it doesn't say. Anyway, we have 17,000 gold. And the truth is, if we looted a bandit that had 17,000 gold, we'd lose our minds, right? Our heads would explode. And so I don't think we really want to risk all of this gold by trying to clear this camp. That doesn't make sense. Now, I mean, if if there was like somebody walking the road who was like traveling with us that was gonna fight with us, maybe. But we're not that stupid to try and do this by ourselves. So we have two options. We can try and run through it or we can go around and cross on horseback. And I think, I think we're gonna go around. I think we're smart enough to realize that just uh, straight up... Oh, look, an urn root. Ooh, a piece of candy. We'll take the urn root. And it looks like they see us, too, right? So we'll cross the shallows here. I think the horse should be able to make it, right? Yeah, just barely. So we could have tried running through, but we can see Robber's Gorge is notorious for being held by by bandits. So it wasn't as epic, but I'm pretty sure we made the smart move. Oh, looks like we're officially entering. Who was who was that? Oh, we're under attack. No, give me my, my orcish thing. Oh, all right. Still after us. Who we got? Who we got? Go ahead. Try and fight that. He's got heavy armor, and but where's the crossbowman? Okay, we're officially under attack. So that's good. But I can't figure out who had the crossbow. Alright, we still have a crossbow trying to kill us, and we have to be careful. Our horse is taking a lot of damage now. We don't know where the crossbow- Oh my god, there's a pack of wolves! And they took out the pack of wolves? Here, hold on. We need some stamina. Uh, yeah, we'll do a decent one. Got one of them. And, uh, uh, uh. Oh, I missed. 
Hey, very nice. There's two wolves still on the uh, on the path there. But I think we're all set. Wow. Ooh. Let's put a healing aura on our horse, right? And I think we're gonna take everything, including all the, the meat, right? Just take everything. Who was this? This person, right? Where Was this the one that attacked? One of these people just randomly attacked, right? Elven War Axe? My goodness. Yeah, it was this guy. This Khajiit randomly attacked us on the road here. Randomly attacked everybody. Let's go take out these wolves. We're over encumbered now, but... Here on. We'll run over one and uh, hit the other. Oh! <laughs> Or just run over both. That works too. Not exactly the plan, but you know, who needs plans? So this was the dead guy in the middle of the road here. This was the other bandit that we killed. Great, and this must have been, I don't know, their stuff, a trap. It's hard to say. We don't need broken equipment. Wow. Okay, well. Move right along then. Oh, don't worry, we cleared the path for you. Oh, oh, we did it. <laughs> Watch out. We'll let them do the fighting. Oh, you know what we can do? We can practice using our bow. We can do, uh... We're not gonna use iron freaking arrows. Aww. You know why? We didn't, we weren't prepared. So there we go. We'll be a little bit more prepared now. No, no, stop that bear. Okay, so we're gonna... <laughs> we're gonna field dress the sliding bear. Woo! So it's now 10 a.m. Uh, and uh, we're gonna attempt to harvest this bear for, for ingredients because we might be able to get a lot of animal fat out of it. So that's what we're doing. Nice, that, oh, that took like an hour, but bear claws, eyes, a heart, teeth, and what I'm really hoping for is 10 animal fat. Excellent. We could skin the pelt. Yeah, why don't we practice? I mean, honestly, we, well, we don't really, nah. We really only care about the ingredients. Eventually, if we start fighting dragons, it would be nice like, we only care about harvesting the ingredients, you know, and the blood you just kind of do automatically, so. Well, now I'm happy that they happen to walk by. <laughs> All right, I think, yep, here we are. We are here. So we'll jump off and uh, we did it. We, we found the refuge. What we're gonna do is we have we have so many items we have to sell, right? Just just looking at our inventory here, we have all of this other stuff. So and and apparently two random carrots. So what we're gonna do is we are gonna enter there in our next episode. Uh, off off like camera, we're gonna go in. We're gonna sell all of this other junk that we have in our inventory, and that is going to be our episode for the day. So join us next time where we officially enter and join the Dark Brotherhood. So thank you all so much for hanging out with us today. We got into a lot of trouble, which was a lot of fun. So have a wonderful night. Thank you. Bye.